one of the challenges that uh, a lot of new beekeepers have is lighting a smoker and keeping it lit. Because the first thing um, that you want to do is to be able to, number one, light that smoker and create cool smoke for the bees. But the second part of that is keeping it lit. No one wants to be in a bee yard surrounded by bees and your smoker go out. So let's, let me show you how to do that. First thing you're gonna do is get your smoker, and of course this one's been well used as you see, and I put a little starter material here. And in this case, I have uh, cypress shavings because I, I work my bee boxes in cypress and these are the wood shavings from them. So I'm gonna go ahead and light that up. Let it burn and, and as you can, can see there, you know, it, it's burning a little bit. I'm gonna give it a few puffs. And you wanna puff it, and you want that smoke, that fire going really strong, because you're just getting it lit right now. So I'm kinda getting it, getting it lit. And you can use any kind of smoking material you want. If you have uh, pine needles, um, burlap sacks, almost anything. You want something that's gonna burn slow. Well, you see, this is burning kinda fast. So now what I do is they have these wood pellets that I'm gonna go ahead and put in there. I'm going to continue to smoke. So I'm getting some pretty good smoke going now. Put a little more. So if you can kind of see in there, you know, it's, it's uh, starting to really get going. Don't be in a hurry lighting your smoker. It takes a little while to get it going good. So it's actually going pretty good right now. So we'll, we'll put, the, put the top on and you wanna put your hand in front of it and feel it. If it's warm, you don't wanna use it on the bees because you don't want to go and barbecue your bees when you're trying to, to, trying to just check on them. So this is nice, cool smoke and that's exactly what we want on the bees. 